right now, the best in science and medicine are talking, and we need to listen. What we're seeing now in actual real time is something that's unprecedented. This is something that we have never seen before, at least in our generation. You know, we, we have an extraordinary confrontation on the health and the welfare of the globe. Let's look at the science behind what these experts are telling us to do. First, stay six feet away from people in public. Most of us are five to six feet tall, maybe a little more. Picture yourself lying on the ground, then add or subtract a bit to get to six feet. This imaginary ring shields you if an infected person coughs or sneezes nearby. Germy droplets will come out of the person's mouth in an arc and fall to the ground before they reach six feet. If you are closer, even if you are outside taking a walk or playing basketball, you could inhale the droplets and get infected. Now, you might say, I'm not coughing or sneezing and neither are my friends. Here's the thing about COVID-19. You can be infected and contagious and have no symptoms. If you get close to somebody at high risk, say your grandparent, a friend, or a stranger passing by, you could infect that person without knowing it. Experts say, wash your hands with soap and water for 20 seconds and do it often. Here's why. Imagine this glow-in-the-dark powder is the coronavirus from an infected person who touched this doorknob. It's invisible in normal light, just like the virus. When you open the door, it gets on your hands, then all kinds of things you touch, including your face. Remember, your eyes, nose, and mouth are the virus's door into your body. Keep your hands away. Hand washing would have stopped the spread, and it really does take 20 seconds to do it right. During that time, soap breaks down the outside of the virus, and that takes away its ability to attack your body. Stopping too soon can leave some of the virus on your hands. It's like erasing a word. A couple rubs won't do the job. You have to go back and forth a lot. And finally, let's take a look at a key weapon to fight germs, sleep. When you sleep, your body's immune system is actually very busy. It arms itself to prepare for an invader. If you are already sick, the immune system goes to battle to fight infections like coronavirus while you sleep. You wanna aim for eight to nine hours a night. When you don't, you shortcut your body's defense system. The bottom line, social distancing, hand washing, and good health habits make a difference. Follow the advice of experts and be a strong link in the chain of actions that will bring good health to our globe.